Good morning to you. It's uh, 7 straight up on this Thursday. It's uh, the coldest morning in quite a while. In fact, we are near freezing in spots like Hillsboro and Scappoose. Much of the area has fog. We have the east winds out near the gorge up to about 20 miles per hour in spots, and that's producing clear skies out that direction. And will help, you know, mix out the fog and bring clear skies to the North Valley. I think during the morning hours, we'll start to see some clearing. You folks down in Salem could be a little bit longer, but at this point, I think odds are good that all of us will see sun and be back up into the 50s. You know, tomorrow forecast charts still show no measurable rainfall uh, for a number of reasons. I'm going to continue to tell you that light showers could develop tomorrow. We will have the cloudiness back on Friday. But if you have plans, just note that, you know, much of the day could be dry and maybe the forecast charts are correct and we don't get anything. But I, I'm going to tell you possible showers for your Friday. Rain uh, on Saturday still looking likely coming in during the morning. However, and I don't know if I believe this or not, but however, this morning, forecast charts have really backed off on how much rain we get Saturday. But there will be occasional shots of moisture coming through on both Saturday and Sunday. The wettest day of the bunch looks to be Monday, which makes sense. That's when this big warm front comes in, and we could have rain all day, and it could be upwards of an inch of rain falling. Again, that's Monday. And this warm front, Sunday night and Monday, could produce the highest winds that we've had at the Oregon coast um, so far this fall season. Reason to believe that there could be a period of winds gusting as high as 80 miles per hour or better. Uh, again, that's Monday. Now behind this front, let's talk skiers. Good news, we still have occasional rain expected into Thanksgiving Day. Snow levels 4,000 feet Tuesday, then back down to 3,000 feet with some snow accumulating on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. So if that's the case, you know, I mean, it could be close. We could be opening for Thanksgiving weekend on the slopes. We'll see. Have a great Thursday.